I can communicate with magpies. Oh. <laughs> wow. Right. Do you mean, um, like, the footballers? <laughs> uh, no, no, I can't get through to can't them. Can't get through to them. <laughs> no, one can, no one speaks that language. So, no, no, the, Bert. And, and where? In what sort of oh, instances are, are you even seeing magpies? No, I'm in my backyard. There's lots of mag there's magpies basically all over Australia, aren't there? Yes. And in my place at Northcote, there certainly are some. When did you first realise you had the gift to be able to communicate with magpies? Well, I can remember we were sitting in the backyard and we were listening to the magpies <laughs> and it was my, my son and my wife and I and we all tried to do magpie impressions, like, like you know, just to, sort of doing the... I was trying to do it like a little... Um... What? Can you do that again? I'm not an ornithologist. Is that no. a magpie? No, a, a, a magpie's more a... Everyone's gonna have <laughs> Frank? The magpies in North could have a different dialect, obviously. No, no, I'm no, not here. I, to uh, we're neighbours. Yeah. Okay. So... Oh, well, maybe you're just communicating to each other over the fence. You think it's magpies. <laughs> <laughs> Now, go on, have a, have a quick conversation. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> oh. so, so Can I just say some... that was so much more entertaining than Studio 10? You should just do... <laughs> <laughs> You're so up with the news. I left Studio 10 two years ago, but anyway. <laughs> No, that hasn't gone off. But anyway, back to Frank. So we were doing these impressions, mm. and then what happened was a little baby magpie, a little baby one, comes into the, the backyard, and I was having, like, a little bit of a kind of a ham thing with my breakfast, and I chucked it over into the backyard, and the, the baby went and got it, and then the mother, instead of going to the baby, came to me for a little bit more. Mm. And so I gave her a little bit more, and then those two kept coming every day from then on. And when I say communicate, basically what you I can... feed? You mean feed? Yeah. No. <laughs> no. No. No, he's no. getting there. He's getting there. I swear, I've got the most beautiful photograph that you can imagine of this baby magpie on my arm, taking a little bit of meat from my mouth. It's absolutely beautiful. From your from mouth. Your did, mouth. You spew, yeah. did you spew into it? <laughs> Sorry, taking... I was just thinking about the photo, so I got distracted. From my hand. So I've got this beautiful we'll, photo. We'll do, we'll do an impression right now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> it's one of the most beautiful... Sorry, ones. I misspoke. Sounds pretty good. It sounds like you give a lot, but if they speak to you, do you understand what they're saying back? Basically, whatever I do as a magpie, that means I've got meat, and I will hear them say, which means good. <laughs> so the word for the word for good in magpie is as long as the word for I have got meat. I didn't say that I can speak the language of magpies. I said I can communicate with magpies. I'm not buying this for a second. Oh, see. I was really starting to buy it. And, uh, you know, what got me across the line is um, the, the photo with the baby magpie on Frank's hand. I mean, I saw, I saw love in Frank's eyes. What are you thinking? Yeah, I think it's true. You think Frank... Can... No, I don't. I, it, as Frank said, it's not literally talking to <laughs> no, it's, a it's... magpie. It's just the you announcement think... of, so I've got this. So we're asked to believe, do we believe Frank believes he can communicate with magpies? Yeah. I've, I'm starting to backflip. Oh. <laughs> starting to freak yeah. out, yeah. I'm very happy to, you know, be yeah. democratic about this. I'm not buying a single okay. word of it. Okay, you go, yeah. You but, go, let's go but with you the are. Line. Yeah, but, I, you know, take it away. <laughs> and you're just in the middle. Yeah, I think, I think, I think I'm going to go with lie now as well. well. We'll say lie. Frank Woodley, was that a lie or the truth? Well, that was actually the... <laughs> Lie. Oh. Well done. Chris went with his gut. Bravo. Yes, yes indeed. It was a lie. Frank can't really communicate with magpies, despite being very good at the impression.